Yeah, hey, uh, this is to show you how to get your thumbsticks to to glow different colors. I've got a uh, seven color LED that I soldered in here. It uh, changes seven different colors in a slow pattern. Um, I'll unplug it so my controller only works when it's plugged in. Uh, I messed something up, but I'll unplug it here so you can see where the wires are going. So I basically just. All it is is four pieces of wire and two LEDs. I've got the positive wire going to the positive end of um, each of the LEDs. You can see right there. There we go, focus in a little bit. And then for this LED, it comes down there. I've got the LED sitting right at the corner of the thumbstick. Um, when the shell is off, it will hit the LED, but when you got the top of the shell on it'll be fine it's got plenty of room to move around it won't even hit it so you can see the wire going to the positive side of the LED there and then right there that's the negative and then I have that grounded to the negative um, battery post I guess you could battery terminal on the controller and then for this one I've got it mounted right in the front of the thumbstick not in the corner like the last one and again when you move it it's gonna move around but it's not going to affect um, it's not going to affect it when the top is on so you can see the positive wire right there and that's going all the way over to the positive of the LED now be careful when you're running your wires because you don't want your you don't want them to go underneath your um, conductive pads otherwise it won't feel right when you're when you're playing and then for the negative on this one I actually just have it soldered uh, right there to the metal here on the thumbstick and I my wires are all too long um, years don't have to be this long I just made them long just in case I ran into problems you can always shorten them I'll plug it in to show you um, how they work You can see them changing colors. And they are pretty bright. Colors don't always match up. my controller on gives it better power. I've also got some orange and white LEDs installed on here. So it looks fairly nice. Got the purple going with the pink. That's gonna fade into a blue or a white. So yep, that's a pretty easy way to get your thumbsticks to glow rather than buying the whole kit for I don't know what are they fifteen dollars now or something like that those kits are fairly easy to install but this is pretty much a cheap easy way to do I think I bought the LEDs for like four dollars again just one more time just in case I'll show you how the wires are so you got the positive going up to the LED coming down to the positive side of the LED then you got the negative going straight to the controller right there same thing over here you got the positive going to the LED coming over to the positive on the LED and then the negative I have it grounded to the metal up there you can see it through the bottom of the thumbstick and that's that if you have any questions uh, leave comments make sure you use some hot glue to uh, get your LEDs to stay where they are that'll help you later on down the road then you won't have to mess around. Having two people helps um, with this so one can hold on to something. But uh, good luck.